The 2023 Dodge Challenger Demon 170 drives greenest when making 1,025 HP. In 2018, Dodge released the beast of all muscle cars onto the streets. The 840 horsepower Dodge Demon was the only wheelie capable production car before the NHRA ban. Just when everyone thought that politics killed off the likes of the Demon, Dodge surprised everyone with a new alcoholic menace. The 2023 Dodge Challenger Demon 170 is an ethanol powered, wheelie popping, record breaking monster. The newly revealed muscle car will be the last to pack Dodge's iconic V8 in its raw form. But the automaker refuses to go out without a massive bang. The 2023 Demon 170 will produce an ear-splitting 1,025 horsepower and needs a drag chute to slow it down. But the impressive feat is that the Demon 170 is the cleanest Dodge Challenger yet. Dodge Demon 170 is the most powerful Challenger yet. The ancestral Hemi engine of the Dodge SRT Demon 170 has undergone several transformations, crowning the muscle car as the most powerful stock Challenger yet. The V8 engine produces a majestic 900 horses and 810 pound-feet of torque when running on 91 octane, more on that later. The supercharger now has a larger intake and a smaller 3.02-inch pulley, boosting the pressure by 40% to 21.3 psi. The addition of a power chiller system diverts the air conditioning system to the supercharger, giving it a whiff of cool air to keep temperatures optimal. The Demon 170 isn't the most powerful Challenger, just on paper. The unholy beast has the ability to cover a quarter-mile drag strip in just 8.91 seconds, reaching a top speed of 151 miles per hour. With such impressive numbers, it's hardly shocking to learn that the National Hot Rod Association NHRA, has banned it from drag races. This is because it doesn't come with a roll cage and a parachute as standard. But Dodge's new monster isn't just the fastest challenger. The Demon 170 holds the title of the world's fastest production car in the 0-60 sprint, completing it in just 1.66 seconds. The previous title holder, the Aspark Owl, claimed 1.7 seconds, while the Remitz Nevera and Bugatti Chiron Supersport recorded 1.95 seconds and 2.4 seconds. Dodge CEO Tim Kuniski said, to celebrate the end of the Hemi muscle car era, we pulled off all the governors to reach a new level, a new benchmark of factory crazy production car performance. The Demon 170 churns more HP on an E85 ethanol gas blend. The 900 horses are not all Dodge has in stock, pun intended, for drivers. The Dodge 170 has a secret 125 horsepower locked away behind its choice of fuel. The muscle car can run on flex fuel, giving you the option to choose between ethanol and petrol. Ironically, the Demon performs best on the greener fuel option. Dodge teased their ground-trembling green plans in the lead-up to the unveiling of the Dodge Challenger SRT Demon 170. A five-video teaser series featured the Corn Demon, which hinted at the key to unlocking the full horsepower of the vehicle. That's where the name, 170, comes from, referring to the 170-proof alcohol produced from corn. The muscle car employs a recalibrated powertrain control module, PCM, to optimize fueling and spark timing for premium and high ethanol blended fuel. The ethanol percentage appears on the vehicle instrument cluster, and a gas pump icon appears when the beast detects a significant percentage of ethanol in its fuel tank. The horsepower rating is adjusted automatically and displayed based on the ethanol percentage in the fuel. When the ethanol content reaches a 20% threshold, the gas pump icon in the cluster turns white. If high ethanol fuel content of over 65% is detected, the cluster icon changes to blue, signaling that the Demon's maximum output of 1,025 horsepower can be unleashed. The 2023 Dodge Demon 170 interior offers a comfortable ride. The new Dodge Challenger SRT Demon 170 boasts a significant horsepower increase, but Dodge keeps the interior unchanged from other Challenger models, not that anyone is complaining. The standard interior includes a single cloth driver's seat, but buyers can opt for optional Napa leather on both front buckets. A commemorative set will be included when buying a Demon 170. What's in it? A Demon-themed decanter engraved with the car's unique VIN, as well as coasters, whiskey cubes, 
rocks glasses, and other bin-specific items. Optional features include heated and ventilated seats and a heated steering wheel. The Uconnect system powers the Challenger's infotainment touchscreen. This includes standard features like Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. To reduce weight, the Demon comes with a standard two-speaker audio system, but buyers can upgrade to Harman Kardon's 18-speaker sound system. The 2023 Demon 170 will be scarce, with a total of only 3,300 units to enter production. The US MSRP stands at $96,666, while the Canadian MSRP goes up to $134,785. Dodge plans to manufacture up to 3,000 units for the US market and an additional 300 for Canada. Production will begin in July, and the last one will roll off the assembly line on December 31st. Bidding a bittersweet farewell, the last pure V8-powered Challenger will dominate races for years to come, marking the end of an era.